I mean, when you're, when you're reading the script and you're breaking it down, are you, uh, are there times where you have to use your imagination in the mm -hmm. scene, you know, where you're like, Hey, this could be my dad dying for real, or this could yeah. be, I mean, how, 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 what was that process like? Yeah, no, I remember having those conversations with you and with Tony and with Maurice, you know, at the time. And it was a lot of really interesting just experiments of how, how to go about it. And um, yeah, it is, it, it's imagination. And I think on a deeper level, it's, it's um, some kind of empathy and compassion, you know, Mm. almost in a not to be too grandiose but from my perspective it's like it's a almost a cosmic empathy with with humanity you know mm. so i don't necessarily have to ha go through a drug addiction myself to look at someone who is going through that let's say and and have my heart ripped out uh because of what i'm witnessing sure. so you know that was sort of the foundation um was and I struggled with these things a lot, you know, in general hospital. And it's, it's so, it's an incredible, incredible place to work through these things. I mean, I remember because you get to experiment and if it doesn't work, it only airs once. Right. Right. Not, right. right. You, you get, get another get, chance. Yeah, in in <laughs> you know, history so much. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I would watch the shows, you know, because I, I at an early age, I wanted to, to feel because I could remember what I felt like during the scene. And then I got to see a couple weeks later how it came off. And I mm -hmm. thought, oh, interesting. That was much bigger than I thought. Or, wow, that didn't, that didn't actually come through at all. And you, so you, you, know, you try to kind of gauge to feel what you're doing subjectively, how that's actually going to come across you know, uh, for the audience.